Happy Christmas. Merry Christmas. Well, technically it's not Christmas yet, but it's so close that it's time for a special Christmas video. In the beginning, I would like to say thanks to everyone who already followed me. It might not seem like a big number, but for me it, it is. Thanks. From the title, if I didn't put a clickbait on it, you can tell what we'll be making today. Ah yes, Christmas time. Time when at a certain age it turns away from the magic time of getting gifts from Santa into becoming Santa yourself and having to buy them from your money. There's this whole list of top most buyable gifts for Christmas for humans, but what that list would look like for Antro characters. So in today's episode we'll be making top 5 gifts in my opinion and you're right to not agree with, but it's my channel on my video so I can do it my way, okay bye. In the world of anthropomorphic animals. During the time lapse of me making that list, I also asked my followers on Twitter to give me some questions so I could answer them in Q&A segment. In the beginning I wasn't happy how my characters look except for bunnies, so I was mainly drawing them. They're just his cosmetics to make him look tough, like he just came from a fight. Depends. If I want quick food I would eat hot dog because they are easy to make and fast. But if I want to feel more full I would pick burger. I don't have and I don't think I would want one. I'm more of a cat dog person. would say both. It really depends. For example I like doing fan art and getting one equally. All my drawings are equally loved. Iced tea, lemon flavor. Rabbits, maybe foxes. I like the Christmas vibe and I don't like the Christmas rush. According to my mom, before I could even walk properly, it's always been my hobby, never went to any art school, always wanted to do something on the side of my notebook. Believe it or not, I usually do random rabbits and paint them without any goal in mind and the ones that I like usually stick with me. Depends, 2-3 to three hours usually, sometimes longer when I'm in my mood. Probably foxes because of their fluffy tails. Left. They're cute looking and I have a secondary character that is a possum. That's an idea for a future video. Donald Duck's comics. Wanted to make my own comics always. Those medieval gestures but devoid of color. Not much or anything crazy. Get better at art. Make more videos. Just being crafty. I'm drawing on iPad. I use Procreate. And typical Christmas with family, you know how it is. End of Q&A segment. I want to say thank you for everyone who submitted some questions. I answered most of them. And maybe we'll do it in the future with my YouTube audience this time. Now let's get back to the topic of this video. first gift that I drew is snacks and I think it's because the food is the universal object that everyone craves. Not that because we have to eat but because everyone likes to have a snack from time to time. Second would be some creams and accessories to keep hooves, horns and claws in top shape. Just like we got creams for hands, face etc. Still in the topic of taking self-care, we got brush and fur conditioner to keep those animals hair untangled and nice looking. Now what every kid likes it would be some toys, but even adults could use some anti-stress squeaky toy in the shape of a bone. And last but not least, and especially important for all of our cold-blooded lizards and snakes, clothes to keep them comfy and warm. 
And those would be my top 5 gifts in a world where animals had to engage in capitalism. What do you think of them? Maybe you got some cool ideas as well? Tell me in the comments. And again, happy holidays to all of you and thanks for following and liking my content. See ya next time. Bye! Happy Christmas!